The crash of Flight 1363 resulted in dozens of recommendations that could save lives. The crash of Flight 405 ensured those recommendations were widely implemented. Well, there was a lot that came out of Dryden. I mean, uh, the commission came out with 192 recommendations. Uh, it changed uh, the whole nature of how we approach contamination. We now have uh, the runway and uh, de-icing uh, pads so they can get a final de-icing before they take off. This was something directly the result of the Dryden Commission inquiry. Today, most airlines use a new type of de-icing fluid. Type 4 de-icing fluid lasts longer. It will stick to a wing for up to two hours. As well, air traffic controllers must now be able to tell flight crews how long they will be delayed at the runway after being de-iced. Dryden is really the first accident that explored not only what happens in the pointed end of an airplane, but what happens within a corporate culture. It puts CEOs on notice that uh, they can't hide in the woodwork when an accident occurs. Dutch manufacturer Fokker went bankrupt in 1996. Despite this, in 2009, there were still 55 Fokker F-28 jets in operation worldwide, mostly in warmer climates.